Mr. Kimmel. Which one of your seeds said that? I said that. Oh, hi, Mr. Douglas. I'm in a sort of a hurry. Oh, well, in that case, I'll come back when you have more time. <laughs> Mr. Kimball, Mr. Kimball. I came here to see you. Oh. What about? I'm looking for a horse. Well, where'd you lose him? No, I didn't lose him. I want to buy one. From who? That's what I came to ask you. You know all the farmers around here. Now, do you know anybody who has a horse for sale? Let's see. I have it. Well, I don't have it. Mr. Haney has it. Mr. Haney is the last man in the world I'll buy a horse from. But I tell you, I was Mr. Fred. Would you keep your mouth shut? At least until I've sold you. How much are you going to ask for me? Fifty dollars. Do you know how much I used to get for one TV show? If you don't keep quiet, it's the glue factory. If I had just saved my money instead of blowing it, betting on auto races. Oh, hello, dear Mr. Haney. Howdy, Miss Douglas. Who is that? <laughs> that is the horse that your husband ordered for your birthday. Oh, he's beautiful. So are you, baby. Why, Mr. Haney. Oh, I'm sorry, I just got carried away. <laughs> oh, I love him. How much is he? Well, I was going to charge $200 for him, but since it's your birthday, you can have him for $100. How much? Uh, you have to keep his mouth shut. Uh, he's a fly swaller. <laughs> now, if you just uh, write out a check. Oh, my husband will give you the money. Uh, well, I don't plan on being around town too long, so uh, if I can get it from you, then you can get it from him. Oh, certainly. Where did you get the horse? This is my birthday present. Mr. Haney said you ordered him for me. Mr. Haney! <laughs> get off. But Oliver! Get off! Oh, oh, Oliver. Get off. Come on! Oh. Oh. Come on, there, boy. Here we go. What? what are you doing? I'm taking him back to Mr. Haney. Why? He's such a wonderful horse. We've been jumping over fences and galloping and... If this was Haney's horse, there has to be something wrong with him. I'm taking him back before I have to pay for him. I already paid him. You didn't. I wrote him out a check for a hundred dollars. I gotta call the bank and stop payment on the check. What a sore head. I used to have a producer like him. There. That ought to hold you till tomorrow. Now, eat it, settle down, and go to sleep. How about a blanket? There's a blanket. Who said that? The cow. Don't be silly, a cow. You'd better close your mouth. There are a lot of flies in here. No, it's not possible. Oh. That's very funny. All right, Eb, where are you? No, he went out an hour ago. I didn't ask you. I must be hearing things. Like what? I could have sworn. Oh. 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 Good night, dummy. 